I was led here, and I definitely recognize this place. This is where Jackie's girlfriend works. She works in some potion shop, so I wonder what... Yeah, right here. Misty's Escotericia and Chakra Harmonization. Let me see Hot and Misty first, see how she's been doing. How's it going with Mama Wells? Pretty good. Maybe too good. Is How's that? that? After we said goodbye to Jackie, she invited me over. We talked for a while. Now, not a day goes by when she doesn't call. Ask how it's going. Tells me about herself, Jackie, everything. Sometimes for hours. Sent me a roast the other day. You believe that? Apparently I'm too skinny. She knows I don't eat meat. I'm afraid she's trying to, I don't know, adopt me somehow. What's the big deal? I wish someone would make me a roast. I think Miss Wells is using me to avoid thinking about her son's death. Oh, with that's a new no good. Surrogate daughter. Exactly. Yeah, it's a tough situation, but honestly, though, if that's the way she is dealing with her son's death, I mean, I know it's a little bit annoying, but. I don't know. I mean, it could be worse, you know? It could be worse. What are you? All right, so... Wait a minute. Hey, so that guy was over there. Now he's over here. Like, who is he? A net runner? For what? Can I not talk to him? That's really rude, I'm sorry, like... Hold on, where am I supposed to be... Where am I supposed to be going exactly? I'm so confused as to where I'm supposed to be going, like... Hold on. I'm just looking at the map here, I'm like so confused, like... Gary the Prophet? Okay, so maybe it, it has something to do with this Netrunner. Do I not talk to him? I feel like I'm wasting my time here because... I'm supposed to be doing a quest in this area, and yet... Wait, hold on. Am I supposed to go upstairs or something? Oh, I got run over. I got run over. This sucks. I did see some stairs, so maybe... Here? Okay. I guess not. This is a waste of time. Okay, I'm gonna find something else because this is definitely a waste of time and I hate this. Like, Cyberpunk, can you give me a clearer direction on where to go to do the quest, bro? Because at this point, this is pretty annoying, trying to find exactly where to go, running around like a headless chicken. Okay, so I'm back at home, and now I'm talking to... What are you doing? I'm perfectly satisfied with my appearance, thank you very much. Sir, please stop. You do fucking what? You deaf? He asked you to do something, politely. Chill the fuck out. It's just an SCSM. Please, just leave me alone! Do it for your mother! I know Helen's very worried about you. The fuck? How you know my mom? You know him? Not personally, but his mother sometimes drops by for coffee. She says I'm a great listener. Can't argue with that. You talking shit about my mama? 
I'll fuck you up. He is not talking shit about your mom, dumbass. He chilled, all right. Brendan didn't mean anything by it. It's not in his nature. How could he mean anything? He's a fucking SCSM, and he's collecting data on my mom. It's called having a memory. Pretty standard these days. Trying to be smart with me? Not really. Why are you defending him? This pile of rust collecting dirt on me for the fucking corpse, yo. Who knows? Maybe you're a corpo agent too. Oh, here we go. What the fuck do you work for, huh? Oh, really? Okay. Thank you, V. Boy, I was scared to my core. I thought he'd paint some mean things on me. The humiliation. Say, since we've been through so much together, I guess that makes us best friends. That calls for a discount. Thanks, Brendan. Oh, shit. Don't worry. You deserve it. You're one tough cookie. And yet, so nice. Not to everyone. I couldn't be mean even if I wanted to. Especially to you. Can't speak ill of the dead, right? Wait, what did he say? Wait, what? You're not supposed to be here. And yet, here you are. Like a glitch in the system. Or a demon coated by a brilliant netrunner. You know what demons are capable of. Right, V? How, how did you know that? Surprised? Lots of people come to me. So, I listen to them and learn how they talk. I caught your name once or twice and pieced together the puzzle. Not bad for SCSM, right? Uh, how about... We'll talk later, all right? Catch you later, Brendan. So, he not only hears people talking about how... I got affected by this chip, but he is one smart machine, and I'm actually pretty concerned about that. The fact that he knows that I was supposed to die, yet I survived, just because Johnny's chip is implanted in my system. I don't know if I should still consider him a friend, or maybe a potential foe. Either way, it's pretty alarming how he's just so casual about it too. I don't know, that machine is slowly giving me some creepy vibes. Oh shit, no! Oh my god. Dude, did I just run over someone? Oh my god, I fucking did. Let me dip, I can't. Ants? No, I'm not- Oh, okay. I thought I rejected the call. Find the details attached. No, 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 chill, chill. I am not the one. Anyways, I'm inside. Woo. Woo, all right. Let me go and find out exactly what he wanted. Can I... Hold on. How are they able to see me if they're outside? Like, uh, my bad. Let me just check my phone quickly. Saint Augustine once wrote, "When one has a healthy sense of smell, he will immediately recognize the stench of sin." Well, even anyone with a sinus infection in this city can smell the fuckfest over at Dicky Twister. <laughs> That's a funny name. This gay strip club- Wow, that's fucked up. <laughs> this gay strip club is full of chicos with glazed, dead eyes who will do anything you desire for an extra eddy tucked into their thongs. The stench coming from that place finally wafted into NCPD command. My little rats tells me they plan to kick down the door any day now, and that's bad news. The owner of Dicky Twister a pimp called Sir Ladrino is no gunk and a fanatic for record keeping. He has a computer full of data thanks to spying tech in his VIP rooms. We're talking politicians, suits, crime bosses, celebrities, maybe even the cops themselves. If the boys in blue get their hands on these recordings, Ladrino's geniusly built house of cards collapses, leaving the whole district in chaos. And... Chaos isn't in our best interest at the moment. 
Kleppel's recordings at the Dickey Twister before the cops do. Thankfully, the Lord has blessed us. Ladrino is currently out of town. But bear to make haste for ignoring divine assistance is a sin in its own right. Alright, I, I get some recordings, so... Except I'm here to fix your sound system. Those built-in subwoofers shaking down the joint. You're not on the list. Hey, you really want, call your boss and ask. But punch in the meter now. Just remember, time's at ease. Fine, whatever. In you go. Thank you. Like, that's what I thought, big boy. Hey! Hey, show your Uncle Garo some skin! You know, for a gay strip club, this place is pretty empty. Oh shit, work it! Work it! Okay, I see you. Um, so where am I supposed to be? Hold on. Alright, I'm gonna head this way. Oh god, are you serious? Who is he? Let me see if I'm able to go by him first. Chill! What the hell? Oh, fuck. Okay. Yep, this is crazy. All I wanted was to at least attempt to get the recordings, but you know what? I gotta make haste at this point. Nah, this is the... Oh shit, hold on. I forgot the cameras. Oh shit. And I can't even use the tech ability. Hold on. I should have just distracted him first and then attempt to open the door, but no, I just got a little too cocky in here. And I died. The fact that the game has me not only travel again, but it led me back to the last mission that I was finishing. And that's pretty annoying. Pretty annoying indeed. Like, come on, man. You mean to tell me you can't save right before? Like a autosave or something? Alright, yep. I already know. Get the recordings. They're very incriminating. So let me try this again. Going somewhere? It's paid to go in. Except I'm here to fix your sound system. Those built-in subwoofers shaking down the joint. You're not on the list. Hey, you really want? Call your boss and ask. But punch in the meter now. Just remember, time's at ease. Fine, whatever. In you go. All right, be cool, calm, collective. Cool, calm, collective. That's it. Shit. Yo, what the hell? What, because of this? Let me turn off all of the cameras here. Like, what else? Is there another camera? Ooh. It's a good thing I'm looking around first. Okay. See, it's a good thing I am looking around. I'm pretty happy. Alright, now let me walk through. Oh, it's because of that camera. Boom. Yes, we're doing it. Where do you think you're going? If it's a hole you want, pick your nose. That's right, you tell him. I'm so proud. All right, is there another camera?
There you go. See, that's not bad. So where am I going? Ew, bathroom. Man, this place has so many cameras. Turn off this camera, and then after that, I'm gonna do a quick... Shit. Oh, man. Nothing? Wow, I did a quick thing, and it was not detected. I am pretty happy. So I'm gonna drop this body here. And I'm sorry, but I just had to do it. What do you expect me to do? I'm not trying to get caught. All right. Let me see if there's another camera here. I am so happy I didn't get caught, too. Because... Fuck. No, 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 no. You did not see anything. You didn't see shit. Okay. You didn't see shit. Oh, use technical ability. I don't have that. That's pretty annoying. Who's able to see me? Who's that? Okay, let me see. I guess I'll go... Ooh, the camera! Remote, let's go. See, look at that. Sometimes with these missions, you could go guns a-blazing, but that's gonna be dumb hard. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Okay, <laughs> I just dipped. What am I supposed to do? Okay. I'm gonna sneak again. The dun -dun bees. Sure, I remember. Jum, you don't forget an ass like that. Are you still there? I'm gonna distract him right here. Hello? Probably one of my groupies. <laughs> okay. Let's check it out. Yeah, check it out. Oh, fuck me. You gotta be kidding me. Shut up! Great. I tried to be sneaky. I'm not good at it, okay? Great. Where's the camera? Turn it off, please. You got any other cameras here? Great. There's some people that are already gonna shoot. Regardless. Like, I'm just trying to find out where the thing is. Oh, thank God. Alright, let me get out. Still data. No! Data, right now. Hurry up. I'm not trying to get blasted again. Cool. Nice. Now let me get the hell out of here. Oh, perfect! I'll jump through here. Oh, lord. Got the file from the Dicky Twister. I rejoice. And so should <laughs> For the contract has been closed and the compensation is on its way. Thank you! Amen. All right, I survived it, thank God, because that was going to be such a pain in the ass for me to do it all over again. Like, really. It really is. Okay, so... What the hell did I walk into? Cock-sucking suits. Um, can I actually just walk into this or fuck you looking at? Nothing to see here. Move along. 
Okay, my bad. I'll just walk away, like... What am I discovering here? What's going on here? This is your first day in Night City? What's it fucking look like? Get out of here, pissant! Pissant? Leave him alone. See this badge? That so. means I can do whatever the fuck I want. No, it does not. Yo, what? What? Wow. Wow. Yo, that's crazy. He said, you see this badge? I can do whatever the fuck I want. Wow. That sounds very familiar. All right, so let me get my Kintan already. Because these cops think... They can do whatever they want, and that is not the case. Fuck you looking at! Nothing to see here. Move along! Take it easy, or you'll kill him. Yeah? And? He your brother or something? The fuck you care! Keep walking before you end up like him. And you're threatening him? You're threatening me? Leave him alone. Wow. You really got badge. the title to that your head. That means I can do whatever the fuck I want. No, it's not. Goodbye. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oopsie. Oh, no. Oh, Lord. I was simply talking to the policemen, and unfortunately, without any of my input, they just fell. Rise and shine, Corpo Swine. They just fell. <coughs> oh, uh. <coughs> Shit. <coughs> well, if it wasn't for you, I'd... Wrong answer. Then, hold on. What do you want from me? The truth. What did they want from you? I have no idea. Mm -hmm. They said something about some slut and a virtue. But when I asked what I had to do with it, they started beating on me so hard, I thought I'd die. Uh-huh. Ah, uh, this city's really going down the drain. For the police to do this in plain sight for no reason. Go on, get out of here. But I don't understand. Just like that. For nothing in return. Nothing. I, I don't, I don't believe you. Why not? You saved me just like that because you felt like it. Don't measure others by your own yardstick, prick. Like, do you want me to kill you too? Do you want me to like steal money from you? Like, what's good? I just saved your ass because I was trying to be nice. So, skedaddle. Hurry up. Yo, this cop got folded. Um, I could see why this certain quest would be problematic. But at the same time, cops do be getting their titles to their heads, so... It's a grim reality. Oh! Oh my god, I can't believe I actually crashed into the wall like that. What is this? Enter Karubo's bar. Good day, V. There is a man who must meet justice. Okay. This is a personal matter. I'll pay extra. Ooh. More info attached. Alright, I just love getting bonuses. Let me see here. There's a time for forgiveness and a time for revenge. There's a time for turning the other cheek and a time for crushing your enemies like the roaches they are. In the words of the prophet Jeremiah, cursed is he who keeps their sword from bloodshed. The man you're to eliminate is Karubo Bariel. He's an old timer, but don't let appearances fool you. He used to be a solo. He killed my friends, people who were like brothers and sisters to me. When all hell broke loose in Night City, he fled to the East Coast. Now he's back, probably thinking everyone forgot about him. But not me. 
Karubu runs a filthy dive that serves as a Valentino's hangout. Go there and show him that nobody can avoid the hand of justice. And try not to make a scene, okay? Be professional. No unnecessary attention. Oh, Lord. I guess this is like a sneak attack. Okay, so let me see here. Who is he? Oh, so that's the guy that I need to kill. So how would I neutralize without raising any suspicion? I'm serious, how would I do this? You know what, let me see if I can like... Ooh. There has to be a way for me to get to the back. How am I, how the hell am I supposed to do this without raising suspicion, bro? And these are the Valentinos, like... I don't know how am I supposed to do- wait! Ah. Okay, so check this out. Distract. I don't know. No, you didn't see shit. So is this how I... Oh, man. Where is he at? He's down there, right? Yeah, he's down there. Okay, let me, let me double check. So, I gotta connect, right? But I don't have... Oh, this sucks. How am I supposed to do this? Let me see if I'm able to... Yeah, that's my character. Uh, hold on. Hold on, let me let me double check. Cause if I could turn off the lights. Take over, ping, access point. Yeah, right here. Huh. Damn, I can't do anything about this. So at this point. I don't know, I guess I'm gonna have to do old school stuff. Fuck. I'm sorry. Yep. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Come on. I'm sorry. What do you want me to do? Oh, this is where I could have done this. Thanks to you, I'll be the one taking Garubo on his journey from our earthly plane, closing the gig. Praise be to the Yay! Nice. I like this. Now it's time for me to hide a little bit and then I'll be gone, I guess. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next time.